gosh, that was like, ah, gross. <laughs> You're but, not okay. allowed to bad talk yourself anymore, miss. Loves me better. Hold on to me. Uh -huh. mm -hmm. Hold on to me. So poochy lips, they, they yes. do two things for you. And I love that you hear when you're not doing it and then you fix it. That's so wonderful, uh -huh. but they help literally yeah. hone and refine audibly, like in real time, your vibrato and your tone cry. You do it sometimes and it's so beautiful. I want it like all the time. Okay. I just love it. I want more of it and more often. I'm sure I have reached the end. Yes. Hold on to me. I can hear it wanting to, but then I can hear also you judging yourself and be like, no. Don't do that. <laughs> That's first thing yeah. you're when you're not a singer. Don't do that. Defend den and pretend den. When I don't feel like I'm yes. worth defending. Hmm. When I'm tired of all my pretending, yep. hold on to me. We're doing a little mm -hmm. bit more of a country twang that I want there, and I want I'm, to back. Yeah, I'm trying not to. Well, it's not your fault. It's the word. But see, when we say the word defending, or I'm, I'm defending myself, it's an ing. Yeah. Which if we sing defending, it sounds so country. So the problem is we just can't sing the way we speak. And in order to okay. sing the way we sound when we speak, we actually can't sing it that same way. So we have to say defending, pretending. Two small little changes there. I think as a result, your vibrato will be even more prevalent on those two notes. Okay. Desperation underneath the weight of expectation hold on to me and now same kind of theme no diphthong on desperation expectation same yeah way. they rhyme we say desperation expectation doesn't sound country but when we sing it the way we speak it it does so yeah desperation expectation so i want you to take away that a y and do more of an a h hold on to me when it's too dark to see you the way you sing the d's on dark every time is just like so good and whatever okay. you're doing don't change it i love your dark okay okay the end work on the high note chorus too so this is where when i am sure i have reached the end that note okay what do you have behind you are you able to kind of pretend like you're lifting that is that heavy don't make fun of me my tree's still up i've been busy <laughs> i love it i love that your tree's still up <laughs> what i want you to do under here if you can is you're gonna take your, your legs and bend them kind of like you're gonna do a squat. All right, so you're gonna go, when I am sure I have reached the end. And I want you to lift up, almost like you're pretending to lift the table up and use your, your butt, your legs, and your abs. Keep your shoulders back. And try okay. to get underneath it as best you can. Okay, so sing, reach the end. Reach the end. Good, good, good. No vibrato. That's okay. Didn't come out. It was because of your jaw, not because of your abs. When I am sure I have reached the end. Ooh, hello. A few moments later. When I am sure I have reached the end. <gasps> that sounded good. <laughs> okay, I just had my first lesson after a month and a half almost two month break. Felt a little bit weird. I was a little frustrated coming in, but now I'm all excited again because that was really fun. Candace is a high performer. She shows up really big and she expects a lot out of herself, which I love because I expect a lot out of my students too. In the last month, month and a half, Candace shot two movies, I think, staying in hotel rooms, on set, back at home. It's a little nuts for her. I still wish my voice were better, but again, I think I've only been doing this for a couple of months, but it's really frustrating to hear yourself sing and know it's not in tune or on key. And when your voice, you can't get your voice to do what you want it to do. 
I'm not a perfectionist, but I have high expectations of myself. She's a bit of a perfectionist. It's really frustrating to want to sound a certain way and expect quick results and not get them. That's the plight of everybody learning how to sing, not just Candace. And I don't like when I, when I don't meet them. So I'm gonna keep working on this. I'm gonna keep practicing. I'm actually really excited to practice again and warm my voice up some more and then try some of these little changes. So um, here goes. I feel really good about where we are. We have completely vocal mapped the song out right now. She knows what's expected of her vocally within the context of the song. And I'm going to give her a lot of opportunity now on her own to massage it into her muscle memory, as well as do some vocal conditioning exercises to continue to expand her range, increase her power, grow her support. By the end of this, I'm confident we're gonna see some measurable progress. And we already have. I mean, the vibrato is blowing my mind. The fact that she is hitting these notes in her full chest voice is also blowing my mind. She's really putting in the work as busy as she's been. I'm counting down the days where I can get back to LA, see her in person, track our measurable progress, and get Candace into the recording studio for her final product. To be a part of the new social media for singers, download the Tara Simon Studios app now, available on iOS and Android.